Vegas. Never a doubt, Joe. Get it was till we hit the wire. <laughs> Scotty, you've been a part of a few milestones. Uh, this guy's on his way. Yeah, he's uh, great. He's a hard worker and a great little rider, and he gets better every day. So hopefully uh, it's very special to win it for Baffert and Mr. Zetras. I, I know it's kind of a quaint saying, but he does kind of make your job easy, doesn't he? Well, yeah, because he works so hard. He's there every day. He never says no. You know, you say, got to work, I'll be there. He never misses. I mean, he ended up missing a day this week. But he would have worked horses if I had some for him, but he just said, I, I'll, I'll work and then I'll go to Palm Springs. And I said, no, you go and take it in. Congratulations, Scott. Yeah. My biggest fan. Yeah. My biggest and only fan. Right here. He's my boy. Jojo. What's happening? Congratulations. Thank you, brother. You talked about your upbringing a little bit. So once again, kind of address the way your parents molded you. And you went out on your own so early. You had to have a solid foundation. Yeah, they did a great job. Uh, they let me leave school in 10th grade, so I was very pleased with that. That helped me. No, I'm kidding. Uh, no, I mean, just... just uh, but for they, the record, you did finish. I did. I did finish okay. the 10th grade. Yes, sir. <laughs> uh, no, I mean, they, they've, uh, I think they, they've been a, a huge portion of my success. You know, just uh, as, a, as a young kid, I, I wanted to be a jockey, and they, uh, you know, they, they patted me on the back with their blessing, you know, and there's not, not too many parents would do that. Joe, you got your whole career in front of you. We wish you all the best. Thank you. Thank you, guys.